Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna show you guys how to make peach cobbler. So this is another easy dessert guys, yet it is so delicious. Oh my goodness. And this is super easy and this is great dessert for this holiday season. Or you can make it anytime you want. And here is all the ingredients that we're gonna need. We have salted butter, pure vanilla extract, Himalayan salt, baking powder, cinnamon, peach slices, cornstarch, flour, brown sugar, and milk. So that's all the ingredients that we're gonna use for this recipe. Without any further ado, let's get started. Let's make our peach cobbler, guys. First thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna melt the butter. So I have the baking dish. This is what I'm gonna use to make our peach cobbler. I'm using all this one bar of butter. So that's perfect. I'm just gonna chop this up into four so it will melt quicker. So there you go, let's chop this baby up just like this. There you go, and then we will put it in the oven and melt it for maybe two minutes, one minute. Yeah, so there you go, I'm gonna put it in the oven. At this point, we're gonna make the butter. So I'm gonna put the flour and then brown sugar. There you go, and then we will put the baking powder, two teaspoon of baking powder. And then we will put a little bit of Himalayan salt. Just a little bit because we are using salted butter. And then a little bit of cinnamon. There you go. And then we will just whisk it for a little bit to combine everything. Oh my gosh. It smells so good guys. The cinnamon. I love cinnamon. It smells so delicious. There you go. I'm done mixing it. At this point we will add the milk. I'm just gonna use one cup of milk. There you go. And then we will pour it in slowly. Just like that. There you go. So let's give it a good mix until everything is well confined. So just give it a good mix until you won't see any more lumps. Good thing about cooking, guys, is you are exercising your muscle. So you're gonna have a strong muscle when you are cooking every day, it's especially when you are mixing. Look at that. So there you go, guys. This is perfect. Now there is no more lumps in it. We're done mixing our butter. So we're gonna set it aside. So there you go. At this point, we will get a new bowl. And then we will combine the peaches. I throw away some of the liquid so it won't be really soggy. So there you go. Now I'm gonna add the cornstarch and cinnamon. There you go. That's perfect. And then we will add the vanilla extract. This is gonna be perfect dessert for this holiday season, guys. So you should try this one, guys. So there you go. We added the uh, vanilla extract. Now we're gonna squish it with lemon juice. Just a little bit to give it a good twist just to balance the sweetness so there you go that's perfect now i'm just gonna give it a good stir i throw away some of the liquid from the peaches guys so it won't be really soggy i just save about one fourth cup i'm just gonna give it a good mix until the cornstarch is well dissolved there you go this is perfect now i'm done mixing it now we're gonna proceed to the final steps guys so we're gonna put it aside and then we will get the dish that we melt the butter in there you go the dish is perfect nice and warm now we're gonna pour in the butter so we're gonna pour in the butter just half of it so we can put half on the top so just half like that so that's perfect we're not gonna mix it we're just gonna leave it like that so that's perfect now we're gonna pour in the peaches so let's pour in all the peaches oh my gosh this is smells so delicious the aroma the aroma of our peach cobbler guys it smells so good it's not even cooked yet so let's just pour it in all of it so there you go that's perfect now we're gonna put the leftover butter so we're gonna make sure we will cover as much as we can this is gonna be crispy on the top and then gonna be 
it's gonna be gooey inside so there you go i'm just trying to pour in all of it so we're not wasting any butter there you go we pour in all the leftover butter this is done now i gonna put it aside and then we will mix the sugar and uh, cinnamon so i'm using brown sugar i'm gonna use two spoon of brown sugar and then we will put a good amount of cinnamon because we're gonna spread it on the top so that's perfect now i'm just gonna mix it really good so let's give it a good mix and then we will spread it on the top of our peach cobbler there you go we mix it really good cinnamon it smells so delicious guys this is optional guys if you don't want the sugar and the cinnamon on top of it you can leave it out now i can spread it evenly i'm trying to cover it as much as we can to make it look so pretty there you go guys this is done we put in all the sugar now this is ready for baking i'm just gonna wash my hands because i got a lot of sugar on my hand so this is ready for baking guys i heat up the oven to 375 and then we're gonna bake this for 45 minutes so there you go stay there baby and then we will get back into it after 45 minutes after 45 minutes there we go guys this is our peach cobbler now i'm gonna take it out oh my gosh it's so heavy and it's so hot guys look at that look how beautiful it is beautiful golden brown it smells so delicious guys i'm just gonna set it aside for 20 minutes before we taste our peach cobbler peach cobbler tastes really good when it is warm after 20 minutes here we go guys now we're gonna do the taste test this is my favorite part guys the tasting time actually this is for our thanksgiving dinner dessert i'm just gonna taste it because we can't finish our video without tasting it so i'm just gonna get a small piece of it so this is perfect this is still hot guys but it's okay because the peach cobbler tastes really good when it is warm you can eat it also with ice cream but i don't have ice cream right now i'm out of ice cream guys so we cannot have our peach cobbler with ice cream so here we go guys we're gonna do the taste test oh my god this is smells so delicious guys i'm telling you this is it smells so good this should be perfect if i have some ice cream but i don't have some ice cream so we're gonna eat it just like this peach cobbler and ice cream goes well together oh my gosh i'm having trouble to pick this peach up so there you go i got it so here it is guys we're gonna take our first bite cheers oh my gosh guys our peach cobbler tastes really delicious it's perfect yeah i'm so happy guys i achieved my peach cobbler it tastes perfect and delicious it just melt in my mouth you guys have to try this recipe for sure you're gonna love this one guys i definitely gonna make this on christmas or new year's this is how delicious it is guys okay guys i'm gonna end this video now i hope you enjoy watching this recipe and i hope you learned something from me today thank you so much for watching and see you guys in the next one if you are new to my channel please don't forget to like and subscribe and click that bell button so you will be notified every time i have a new upload thank you so much guys i really appreciate each and every one of you bye for now and see you in the next one <laughs>